I, I actually, I was just mentioning uh, down there that I, I, I wasn't sure what getting this award meant entirely uh, because um, it's for the Costume Guild and I'm an actor. So I looked it up on the website and it's about celebrating the uh, spirit of collaboration that exists between actors and directors and, and the costume uh, designers. And I really liked that because we couldn't, not, I, I suppose without us they wouldn't, their costumes wouldn't have anywhere to live and without their costumes our characters would be uh, cut off at the knees in a way we wouldn't be able to do what we do so we tell a story together and the fact that this guild believes that I've told enough stories uh, in while collaborating well uh, means a great deal to me Oh, it's a beautiful evening. We were here last year because our wonderful costume de designer Jill Hansen was nominated for Revenge, and so she's uh, she's at it again. She does a beautiful job with our show, and it's, it's just a glorious celebration of something that's such an important part of um, this whole creative process. <laughs> Costumes to me are what signify how I feel as the character because they either constrict you or they allow you to move freely and especially in Mira Mira, Eiko's designs were the epitome of a princess so they had everything to do with it. Oh I know, everyone would say like your costumes are, I, I want to wear them to a party or I want to wear them for Halloween and I'm like I just got to wear them every day and, and, and you have to remember how lucky you are because can, you can get so used to wearing them every day and um, they're just so, they're so, I felt so lucky. I love doing Skyfall. It has been a fantastic film to work on. And to see that I have a nomination for it is a double present. My pal Amy and I are very proud to be here tonight to celebrate our beloved friend and mentor, Mr. Lorne Michaels. Yes. And we are honored that you've asked us to introduce the clip that will bring out the guy who will introduce the person who will present the Distinguished Collaborator Award to our beloved friend and mentor, Lauren Michaels. In January, we did a show with Jennifer Lawrence. At a dress rehearsal, we did a sketch in which she played her character from The Hunger Games being interviewed after the event by a group of reporters. The reporters were dressed as if they were working on TV now. The writer felt that the, contrast, that the contrast would work better. It didn't. I gave the note that the reporters should be dressed like they are part of the same world as the Hunger Games. I asked Tom if that were possible. He just shrugged. Uh, that was two hours before we went on the air. <laughs> 